Hello there, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Mario Party 2. So, I'm gonna pass by the Koopa Bank again. So, unfortunately, lose five more coins, but uh, I do got another star, so fantastic. Yes, it was a close race for that one, so I'm quite surprised I got it. Yeah, yeah, shut up, Toad. Nobody likes you. Hmm, there's a Peach passed by that area? Nope, looks like that's going to be an easy one for Peach to get. After she steals my coins, too. Hmm. Anyways, let's go and buy a skeleton key, shall we? So I can, uh, go, and go up here and I can go through here. Yeah, I'll, I'll miss you too, skeleton key. I'm sorry, but, uh... It's time for me to let you go and move over here so I can get to Boo quickly so I can at least steal, steal Peach's star as soon as she gets it, so yeah. I'm a bit greedy, don't you think? <laughs> uh, one thing I should mention too, for those that are more familiar with like Super Mario Sunshine and whatnot, uh, no, Baby Bowser is not Bowser Jr. They are separate characters as far as I know. They basically play the same role Sort of, but, uh, yeah, for some reason, Bowser Jr. and Baby Bowser do seem to be two different characters. And, uh, don't get used to Baby Bowser either, because, uh, he'll end up disappearing later on in the Mario series. He'll stick around in Mario Party for a little while, but, uh, yeah, for pretty much after Super Mario Sunshine, or, no, not right after, but, what was it, Mario Party 5, I think, Mario Party 6, maybe? I think around Mario Party 8 time or Mario Party 7 time, Bowser, Baby Bowser is basically gone by that point, so, yeah. We will be seeing him in the Mario Party series for a little while, but uh, as far as, like, main series games, I don't get used to it. He, he's not going to appear there much, if at all. Oh, landed one space away from the star. That sucks for you. Ah, oh, crap. Not slot car derby again. Uh, yeah, I hate this game, seriously. Slot car sucks. I don't care what anyone says. Slot car derby is one of the worst mini games in the whole series, in my opinion. Seriously. Uh, this time Mario gets the win. Not surprising. Maybe someone other than me, that's for sure. Okay. Yes, yeah, so it does. Let's steal my coins back from Peach, shall we? That sounds good. I'll teach you to steal my coins in the first place, princess. Hope you learned your lesson, although I'm sure you didn't. I'm sure you're still going to steal my coins next time you come to Boo, and I'm sure that applies to Mario and Luigi as well. And I'm going to steal your star too, because uh, again, I'm greedy. Such a greedy little Yoshi I am. Oh man, I just went through there. Uh, you can't get get to that. Uh, you can't get to that area without a skeleton key and all. But still, it's like I literally just went that way, and now there it is. Where are the odds of that? Looks like uh, Mario's gotta go the long way since he already passed the shop. But uh, yeah, it looks like he's getting sent back to start. So who knows? Maybe uh, maybe he'll get lucky. Though Luigi's got a pretty good head start on him. He's got a pretty good head start on all of us, though, to be fair. So, yeah, and that don't help. So, I definitely think he's probably going to get this one unless, uh, unless he gets blasted away. But, uh-oh, it's time for a battle minigame. So, the entrance fee this time is 10 coins. So, let's see what game we're playing. So, that's obviously something different from uh, Mario Party 1. The these were not in there originally. So it looks like we're playing Hop a Bomb, which is uh, again another game from Mario Party One, but just improved. And you just toss a bomb around, and that's it. Simple enough. So yeah, make sure you catch the bomb with the B button, because if you don't, you'll drop it, and it might blow up right away or something like that. I know in the original it didn't blow up right away. I think I don't think it blows up right away here either, but uh, definitely gives you less time to pass it off, so, yeah. 
If you wonder why I keep passing the Peach, it's because I want to knock her out first because she has the most coins besides me, so yeah. I think next I'm going to gun for Mario or Luigi, or maybe I didn't care which. Yeah, I didn't care which, so yeah. Just blow up on one of them already. There we go. Now just me and Mario, let's see if I can beat him. Alright, there we go. That was easy. So, it is better than the Mario Party 1, just because unlike in Mario Party 1, uh, when it blows up, the game keeps going. In Mario Party 1, it just blows up and the loser loses coins, and it kind of sucks, so... Yeah. And uh, that does mean Luigi doesn't have enough coins now, so... That's good, but I don't expect that to last long. I mean, he only needs four coins, so... He'll get four coins before he gets there, I'm sure. Though this isn't going to help. Though that will. So we got another coin collecting mini game. Those are back from the original. This one, though, I'm going to admit, kind of sucks. Basically, just go around and you collect coins and try not to get sucked up by the sand there. But uh, if you're if you're the one player like Luigi is, you just stand there and shit the sand around, which doesn't really do much at all, as far as I'm concerned. So, yeah, I'm not a big fan of this. Even when you're the one player, it's still meh. Still not that fun. Though Luigi is giving me a hard time collecting coins, holy crap, man. I gotta admit, I am not doing too good this time. Give me the coins. There we go. I wish I could find another money bag. But Mario and Peach keep stealing them from me. And uh, like Baby Bowser did demonstrate, you can get sucked into the bottom, bottomless pit and then you're done for, so that's no good. Yeah, I'm, I'm just not a big fan of that one. It doesn't matter if I'm the single player, it doesn't matter if I'm the lone player, I just don't care for it. It's not that fun. Even when I'm doing good, I just don't care. Just one of those mini-games that, eh, it could have been better. And time for an item mini-game. Again. I'm getting these a lot, aren't I? Yet, yeah, oddly enough, in the uh, later boards, I did not. I did have a hard time getting the item main games, but uh, yeah, for some reason, the first board I just kept getting item main game, item main game, and it was so awesome because I kept getting gold mushrooms and all, and they're so useful and all. But uh, yeah, for the other boards, it doesn't happen as often, unfortunately. Oh, well, Luigi's still standing, and he's got enough coins. It's gonna be a close one. But I do have a gold mushroom, so who knows? I might be able to get a skeleton key and beat him to it. We will see, won't we? Yep, we will see. Alright, now we got Sneak and Snore, one of the more infamous games. At least, it's pretty infamous as far as I'm concerned. Because, uh, you're basically going around in a barrel trying to open up the door and then escape. But you gotta watch out for that chain chomp, because uh, if you don't, he will grab you and put you in a warp pipe that takes you to who knows where. Maybe it's a dungeon, maybe it's a spike pit like in Mortal Kombat, who knows. But like the instructions say, the faster you're going, the harder it is to get in the barrel, and stuff like that can happen. Where you, for some reason you just get stuck, and you're, you're done. You know, that's it, so. Gotta watch out for that, that's why I sometimes get into the barrel beforehand like that, and just hope the AI, you know, gets themselves eliminated so that way I can just take my time now there we go yeah you don't, you don't actually have to go in as early as I am in fact in most games I or most of the time I don't recommend going that quick but uh, since I'm the only one and there's you know plenty of time I figure just play safe take the 10 coins and go so that worked out well. Okay, gold mushroom. Let's see some high numbers. Alright, good. Not bad. Alright, pretty good. 21. Fantastic. 
Screw you, Koopa Bank. You will never be fantastic. And, uh, yeah, let's go and grab, uh, let's grab another gold mushroom, why don't we? I could have technically grabbed the skeleton key and went up and got that star, but, uh, nah. I, I have confidence, what can I say? I have confidence things are gonna work out okay. And if they don't, oh well, I'll be right by Boo. Alright, 40 coins in there now. It's really racking up quick, isn't it? Don't roll a one? Okay, good. Yeah, if you rolled a one, we would have both been blasted away, and that would have sucked. And there's a... There's a new item in there you guys might have noticed if you uh, saw it quick enough, but uh, there's a dueling glove now. Basically what that allows you to do is you can challenge anybody to a duel minigame. But, uh... Again, I will be showing off the uh, dual mini games when we get to them. So now we got Totem Pole Pound, which is, uh, it's fine. Nothing too great about, nothing too bad. You basically just ground pound until you take this uh, totem pole into the ground. Why are you trying to get into the ground? I don't know. Why Why don't you just jump away when it starts to rumble if you don't want to be up there? I don't. I don't get it. I'm starting to think this game doesn't make very much sense. Logic does not exist in the Mario world, what can I say? And one more. Yeah, it was a bit close, but uh, nobody beats me in that game. Nobody at all. At least not the AI. I could, I could see a human player beating me in that, but uh, not the computers. No way, no how. Yeah, ready. Now nah, we're talking about ten. Ooh, 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 ten and ah, oh, you ruined it. Almost got three tens in a row, which made would have made thirty and get me thirty coins. Because uh, that's one thing you get if you get uh, identical numbers on a golden mushroom. You get thirty coins. If you get identical numbers on a mushroom, you get ten coins. So. Pretty cool stuff, if I say so myself. Looks like the next star is all the way out there. Hmm. Well, a bit of a travel, but uh, no problem. I got this. I got this. I'll, I'll find a way to get somehow, and if I don't, oh well. I got four stars, so I'm in a comfortable spot now. Shouldn't have to worry about the AI screwing me over too much now. If you're wondering why I'm choosing to steal from Luigi instead of Mario, it's because he's closer to Boo, and once he gets 50 coins, he can steal a star from me, which I obviously do not want, so... Try to stop it before it happens, shall we? Yeah, if he steals my coins, whatever, but I do not want him stealing my star. Ho ho ho! Nice! Alright. That was a good turn. That was a good turn. What the? What are you planning, Mario? You planning on going to Boo and stealing one of my stars, bro? Are we gonna have a problem? I think we might have a problem here in a minute. Poor Luigi gets five of his coins stolen. Ah, oh, no, not again. Not another battle main game already. This time it's 20 coins, and Luigi don't have enough. Yeah, even if you don't have enough, you play the game anyways. That kind of sucks. Alright, let's see what we get. Crap. This is gonna suck. A lot. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this game. What can I say? It's the same thing as uh, the original. Just uh, pick a switch and hope you don't blow up. And that's it. Literally, unlike the other ones... That, uh, you know, have a little bit of change. This one has none at all. So I don't particularly like this one. Like most of the returning mini games, at least, you know, have got improved. This one, no, it still sucks just as much as it did in the original. Let's try the red one. Okay, I'm safe. Good. Alright, come on, blow him up. Blow up, Mario. Blow him up. Blow him up. Blow him up. Come on, pink. Blow him up. Three, two, one. Darn. All right, blow Peach then. Blow her up. Come on, blow her up. Blow her up. Blow her up. Come on. Three, two, one, zero. Yes. Okay. 
Alright, there goes Peach. Don't have to deal with her now. Just gotta deal with the brothers now. Come on, blow them up, blow them up, blow them up, Bowser. Blow them up, come on, three, two, one, zero. Yes! Okay, awesome. Alright, we're down to three. Down to me and Mario, come on. I just gotta pick the right one, gotta pick the right one, come on. Please let this one be safe. Come on, be safe. Snort at me. Gosh darn it. Ah, uh, whatever. At least I get some of my coins back. Yeah, whatever. At least I get some of my coins back. I, I hate that minigame. What can I say? It's all luck, and that's it. I don't like the minigames that are pure luck. What can I say? Uh, two coins. Or, got an extra two coins. Not bad. Yeah, it's always random who, who gets, uh... An extra coin at the end if that happens, just an FYI. Some it could have been Luigi, but sometimes it's fourth place as well. It's like, yeah, you did the worst, but you still get a coin anyways. It's like what? If anything, it should always be third place. I guess the extra coin, but whatever. And there goes Peach. Everybody's getting blown away by that by that cannon over there, aren't they? Okay, what we got? Totem pole pound again? You gotta be kidding me. I literally just played this game. Alright then. Play it again. At least it's not freaking Bowser's Big Blast. I guess there's that. But uh, anyways folks, that's gonna do it for me. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Later.